I'm Alexei, co-founder and CTO of ClickHouse. We provide the service for this database for many thousands of customers, including almost every AI company like OpenAI, Anthropic, etc. You decided to build your business based on open source. Maybe you can explain why you made this decision and why building as an open source is important. There are many reasons to go with open source. First, open source is a great distribution channel. So you can show your technology for everyone. Everyone can try, and this is really valuable. The second reason is that open source is a great foundation. I want to build a technology that will be around in 50 years. And this is why I do open source. I was talking with a couple of you and other open source entrepreneurs, and what I've seen is that for a lot of people, in the end, the open source version is becoming the most important competitor. How did you manage to overcome these constraints to build great businesses? If you make the open source product really popular, there will be a lot of room for commercial services as well. And there are many possibilities to make a commercial product on top of open source really compelling. This is all about scalability, about how do you manage upgrades, for example. How do the service check all compliance checkboxes, security certifications, etc. And these are intersecting, but different audience. And it is okay if the open source audience is much larger, but there is still a lot of market for commercialization. A big shift happened in the tech industry in the last three years with the big AI boom. I think you're powering a part of this revolution. Alexei, you were mentioning that some of your clients were OpenAI and Tropic. I would love to understand what this shift changed for your company. Some directions are already completely changed by AI, like business intelligence. Until recently, you had to manually configure your dashboards, your charts, but now you just do it from a chatbot that you is using MCP interface for, say, ClickHouse and takes the data from ClickHouse. And this is also one way to make sure that these chatbots give provable correct answers instead of some hallucinated AI slope. You ask a question, they do tens of queries to the database, and they provide these queries so it can be easy to validate. But actually, your question about how do the industry change with AI, it is a very multi-layered question. One part of this question is, how do we improve our product with AI? Another part of the question is, how do we use AI in our work? Do we use AI agents every day to write code? I would say probably database development is the least intoxicated area in this regard. It is a fundamental technology like file systems, like operating system kernels that where you have to take a lot of care managing the code. Do you think this shift will create a new big change in the next five years? What does not change is we always want more powerful hardware, faster databases, and cheaper infrastructure. 